Hello guys and welcome back to another video on the channel I do hope you're doing. Right, today we're going through the final game of the season um, against someone. I haven't checked who we're playing. That is a bad start to the episode. So if you do enjoy it, do press the like button. Do subscribe for more and enable notifications. And do comment below if you are enjoying the save. Um, do press that follow button if you're watching this on Facebook Gaming. It would be much, much appreciated. And that does help the channel out. So I do hope you do enjoy it. And let's get right, right into the video. Cheers, guys. Hello, guys, and welcome back to another video on the channel. do hope you do enjoy it. Today, we're going through the final game of the season against York. As you can see, our form has not been very good. And we have not got the playoffs this season. Um, I think it's the form in these games which we haven't decided to convert into draws. So the Torquay, Maidenstone, Kidderminster, Hartlepool and... Uh, Deutsch Hamlet, all teams around us, we could have won, and that would have been the that would have been beneficial. And we played against the the two big teams in the league. We lost five one two nil. Then these two matches we need points from. So that's probably why we haven't got point. We haven't got playoffs this season. We finished thirteenth with uh, one game to go. We could finish on sixty eight points, but Harrogate have seventy points, so that is not good. At all, um, we have had a good season. Donga, he's done very, very well with um, 19 uh, 20 goals in our competitions. Um, uh, ch ch we'll have a look at the um, we will have a look at the values of players. Um, how do you look at that? Is it on general info? Um, yeah, value of players. So, our highest values Donga, he Richardson, Saunders, Mongo. Um, Sean Davis, Adrian Hutchinson, Lewis Riley, Kyle Lally. So it's all these are the players we need to stick around. So um, we shall see who we are gonna in the next episode. You will see the transfer special. And we'll see who has gone and who has who has left. And we do probably need to do a, need a couple of these to go. I've not offered a contract to a few of them because they need to leave. Um, so the team for the last game of the season is Mobo, Lando, Cashin, Ivings, and uh, is that the team? Is that the team? Yeah, it is. Um, old, I don't know how to say that name, sorry guys. Uh, and then Hyde and Woods in midfield, Hutchins and Saunders on the wings, with McGlynn playing his last game for the club, um, uh, and Donga he up front. Um, hopefully we have a good game out of a few players today and we can see a good few by goodbye to everyone um, just a reminder I do stream on Twitch every day every weekday uh, free till um, half five or six ish so it'd be much appreciated if you come over and have a chat with me and we talk about this save or we talk about the Newcastle save I'm doing over there much appreciated and we're going to the last game here. Lando. Oh, just... Oh, I thought he went in. But it's a corner. Lando. In the box. Hyde. Oh, Saunders does well. Ward. Oh, just got a free kick. Very, very good free kick. Connor Woods. Connor Wood. Well, they, we've had a free kick. They've had a free kick. They've scored from a free kick. We nearly scored from a free kick. Mm. Wood. Well done. Longer he. The Saunders. Tackled. Hyde. To Ivings. To Cashin. To Hyde. To Ivings. Moss. Moss scores. Oh, he's gone wide. Mm. Your car are up the, up the top, so fair enough. And um, what award in the top top there? Oh, just wide. Encourage the boys. Lando. I'm gonna play one in the box. No, it don't work. Soul. Soul is gonna score, isn't it? He's gonna score. Well, good tackle. Very, very good tackle. We have got some good defenders in this season. I feel like we have done something well in defence. So that's very good. 
indeed. Jordan, well arriving, remember, well, Vassal, Wood, well done, Woods, Oscar Woods into McGlynn, to Mdonga, hey, an assist for McGlynn on his final game for the club, Donga he gets the goal, 1-1, one, one. Woods plays it into McGlynn, McGlynn into Dongahi and Dongahi fires home to make it 1-1. One, one. Can we just get a win on the final day? It'd be amazing. I'm happy performance. Keep it up. Wood. Vassal logo. Jamie Sewell has scored for York. It's kind of loud on the bench. Oh, boom. I'm going to sub on Lewis Riley because he's um, ex York. So, this is interesting stuff. In the 63rd minute, we'll make some subs. We're going to bring off um, Sean Davis for Saunders. Wait, Hutchinson actually. Hutchinson's going to come off and he will play as an inverted wing on attack. Um, Luis Riley will come on for Joe McGlynn. And Joe McGlynn will finally get to say goodbye to the Chorley fans. And that is it. It's a 2 1 defeat on the final day as Chorley are finishing the season on in not good form. He just send the little patches in the season, I do believe. That aren't going our way at all, which is not very good. Um, 13th in the league, team secure playoffs. Um, yeah, so we will show you the team preview, um, no, season preview, and we'll then we'll finish the season and we'll go through pre season and we'll go through transfers as well. See end of season review, new arrivals, sign of the season, who's got sign of the season, I'm guessing uh, Nick Jeffs, this guy has been a beast at the back, um, uh, Saunders, Boy, Smith, Hutchinson, Jake Andrews, we haven't signed as many players as we did last season, Cole Jenkinson D, wow I thought that would have been a very good signing, B, C, B, um, D, B, D, a, a few of these will leave as well, so D and F, brilliant. And the board are delighted to finish a mid-table, C for FA Cup and English FA Trophy, C minus. Mm, goals for member Sean Davis. Um, match to remember 2-1 win for Chorley and a 5-1 win for old, against Aldershot was our biggest win very very good indeed so we've gone up on the sponsorship broadcast revenue has gone down because we haven't done well in the cups I don't I think uh, corporate and hospitality has gone up uh, competition prize money has gone up gone down and got match day commercial and retail has gone up uh, we sold 584 shirts. Nongit He, Riley, Richardson, McGlynn, and Gooden. We've got all shirts. How you lined up was Mamoy, Lando, Neesler, Cashin, and Jenkinson. Hyde and Richardson in midfield. Hutchinson and Saunders on the wings with McGlynn and Nongit He up front. So, the awards were Ethan Cashin got fans player of the season. Young player of the season went to Ethan Cashin. Kyle Saunders went, um, got signed in the season. Sean Davis got goal of the season. Um, Donga, he got top goal scorer with 20 goals. Most assists, Naden Hutchinson with 10 assists. Um, most players, uh, most player of the match awards, 5 Donga, he. Um, Lewis Riley, um, 7.1 average rating. Very, very good to see. Most goals by a player in a match, Joe McGlynn with 3 goals. Most goals by a player in a league match, Joe McGlynn with three goals. Very, very good indeed. So our overall best 11 was is Winterbottom, Broom, Baines, Nelson, Richards. You know, is he still at the club? 
No, he's gone. Is, did he play? He's playing in his country, I think. Yeah, Ireland. Um, so Yang Sobo, Louis Riley and Valicius, Hutchinson and Davis on the wings with Dunga He up front. The truly best 11 uh, featuring likes of Charlie Winfield, who was here back in the day. Um, and Ben Bourne, although three of the team have now retired, the rest continue to be involved in the football. Lewis Riley, Sean Davies, Andrew Nelson, Oscar Wood still in the club. With Ben currently playing for Bradford. Oh, is he actually playing? Interesting. Let's see if he's actually playing. No, he's back up, I think. Let's have a look at Brentford. Uh, tactics. Um, not even back up. Not even back up. And it's third choice. Not good. And you can ask me. So, um, Ling is Valicius playing? Might get him on loan next season. He has played one game. But um, if you're on Lincoln, tactics. Is he on the bench? Yeah, on the bench is Valicius in League 2. They've dropped as low as League 2. Wow. So, and then you've got the Harry Cardwell at Yeovil, who is, what division are Yeovil in now? League 2. And they've, no, they haven't gone down. Wow. So that's interesting. Season pro review. Um, yeah. Uh, work within the wage budget, avoid relegation. We'll accept that. And discuss plans for next season. We've done well to avoid will. We've done well to avoid relegation, and we'll do just as well to make sure we aren't involved in a mass on it. That's our target. It's only a long time, and I hope you all have a good break. You're going to need it to come back fully refreshed because I think we're going to be making battle next time around. Well, that one. I always have bad ones there. I always say the wrong thing, but that's a bit annoying. So I do hope you have enjoyed this video. If you do, press that like button, do subscribe for more. And I'll see you guys later. Cheers, guys.